students with significant disabilities learn a whole array of social and academic and self-determination skills when they have opportunities to learn alongside their peers without disabilities. And the friendships that form can bring a sense of satisfaction and a sense of belonging that many uh, students with significant disabilities find to be elusive. So the benefits for students with significant disabilities are really well documented. But more recently, what we've become really interested in is the impact on the students without disabilities who have the opportunity to learn and work alongside their classmates with significant disabilities. And if you spend time talking to these youth, they're really articulate about what they take away from these relationships. They'll talk about having a greater sense of appreciation for diversity in their school. They'll talk about having a greater understanding of disability and how that impacts uh, their classmates. They become advocates for their classmates with significant disabilities. They'll talk about personal benefits like a greater understanding of themselves and their strengths Thanks. a greater sense of empathy and uh, better attitudes towards people with disabilities in general. They start talking about the friendships that have formed and the relationships that develop from these interactions. Um, and remember, these are the future co-workers. These are the future civic leaders, community leaders, congregation members. These are our future citizens. And so the opportunities that they have to work alongside and get to know their classmates with significant disabilities, we're finding that can have a long-term ripple effect on a community. Increasingly, conversations about inclusive schools and inclusive communities uh, recognize the fact that a community is stronger when the gifts and the strengths of everyone in that community have an opportunity to be shared. And our work with uh, inclusive schools tells us that when students with significant disabilities have opportunities to be part of the life of a classroom and a school, that other students in that community also benefit from having the opportunity to get to know their classmates, to learn about their strengths and their gifts and their contributions to that school. We hear over and over from the young people who are part of these peer support arrangements that they're starting to see people with disabilities in a completely different light. Not in terms of their deficits and their weaknesses and their labels, but in terms of their personalities and their relationships and their friendships and their gifts. And so those opportunities in a classroom to discover those things, if we can create context within our schools for more and more young people to encounter the segment of their community, the larger community becomes stronger because the gifts of everyone becomes represented.